He's gonna open the uh, probably use of the label after this. <laughs> So this is the maqam of Prophet Yusuf. This is where, apparently, according to local historians, Yusuf alayhi salam is buried. Come on, Bismillah. Take off. Did you say this was according to local historians? Yeah. So either he's buried here or well under. Around the perimeter. Yeah. Or directly under. Remember, this masjid is built on a graveyard. graveyard. So right now, you are standing next to or in the same area of the beautiful, handsome Prophet Yusuf alayhi salam. <coughs> One beautiful lesson that we learned from the life of Yusuf was that he was tested many, many times. He was thrown into a well, he was sent into a prison, he was tested by his own blood, his own family. But yet, subhanAllah, he experienced all of this and he still kept his trust in Allah. And in the end, you know how the story plays out, how it finished. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made him the minister of Egypt. At the time, they had the drought and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made them live seven years of poverty, seven years of richness, and he was the minister. He was looking over all of this. So the lesson that we can learn is me and you, all of us, we're going to go through trials, tribulations, tests in our life. We're going to have highs, we're going to have low, lows, but if you put your trust in Allah, just like Prophet Yusuf salam did, then inshallah, we will have the best ending. And, inshallah. And what, what can be the better ending than leaving this world with the kalima? Everybody, La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and to be given our entry into paradise. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reunite each and every single one of us, our family members, in the gardens of paradise. Amen. Amen.